Hello, Richard and Michael. This will serve as your training for Mission Memphis, or at least your information um, for Mission Memphis for loading and for setting up the Kid City. Um, Richard, I know that you're not in charge of loading, but Michael, you are, and so I'm just including both of you on this message. Um, so a couple of things. One, I texted you both a copy of the Kid City note. Um, so that's not in a Google Doc. That is in our iPhone notes. Um, so it's called Kid City, and you should be able to reference that. That tells exactly what is needed for each component of the building. Um, it also has the tools that are required. We have um, purchase tools for that. Um, they're not all here, but they should be here before Sunday. Um, if you have any of those tools, feel free to bring them and then keep them with you at the end of the day because I don't want your personal things to get lost. But um, yeah, so we'll have all that listed there. And then at the bottom of that note is a diagram to show where each of the cities will go um, when we get there for um, kids set up. So that's that. When it comes to unloading or taking it down, um, the least amount of disassembly, the better. So if we can leave the legs on, um, you'll see what I'm talking about when we get there, but if we can leave the legs on and then just detach the three segments of each building, that would be beneficial. Um, Eric has said that we can use the area beside the broken back gate, and we'll see that when we get there on Monday, but we can use that area and put a tarp over it at night to store it. So hopefully everything will go well. Um, each Kid City will have two sandbags for every leg. Um, so there should be, I believe, six sandbags per building. So six sandbags for the school, six for the church and so on. So um, that would be that part of the setup. And then as far as the takedown, that's how that rolls. Um, when we start to load things on Sunday, my plan is to go pick up the U-Haul truck at two o'clock and then bring that back to the church. The U-Haul truck is what we will use to load the tables, the benches, um, the boards, the buckets, all of those things, the tents, and then all of the supplies. In the black trailer, um, we will take two the bus barn as well, or to the green barn by the lake. And that is what we will load the Kid City and the sandbags in. Um, and that Kid City takes up almost the complete black trailer. Um, so we'll plan to put that in there. If we run into a problem on Monday, then we will plan to take the black trailer with us every day and we will just disassemble the complete city and put it back in the trailer at the end of every day. That is. That is plan B, that is not plan A. Um, but as far as getting it there, that's how we'll get it there. So on Sunday, we'll meet for lunch and then I will have um, likely Connor, um, not 100% sure, but I will have someone driving my truck with that black trailer up to the barn to load the kids' city. So um, Connor can show y'all where that is. And then I will be headed to pick up the U-Haul truck and as soon as I get that truck, then I will come back and meet y'all at that same area to get the tables and the boards and all of those things. Um, so that is the loading part. And then the unloading or the getting it all back, we'll be doing that on Friday. So as soon as VBS is over at three o'clock on Friday, um, we will bring pretty much everything back. Um, we will keep one yellow tent um, that will be for um, to use on Saturday, but everything else um, we'll bring back. If that changes, then I'll let y'all know by the end of the week, but um, we'll plan on bringing everything back on Friday at three, and then we will, um, I'm so sorry, my son just texted me. We'll bring everything back Friday at three, we will unload and be pretty much all but done with the setup, and then we'll have some things for Saturday for the kids' carnival, so um, yeah, I think that does it. I will see y'all on Sunday. Let me know if you have any questions. Thank you.